Detective. I'm Officer Avery, and this is Agent Kaczynski. The FBI needs your assistance. What do you know about a killer called The Master? He's killed three victims so far, and frankly, we could use your help. He also sent us a letter specifically asking for you to work this case. I know how it sounds, but he threatened to keep killing until you're involved. Here's what we have so far. Contact Agent Kaczynski or me if you need anything. Weird that this sicko wants you on the case so bad. Maybe I should keep an eye on you, huh? It won't be easy to find the killer. The police keep their eyes open, but he doesn't leave much evidence behind. However, it's notable that he killed most of his victims at midnight. Some people believe that the moon affects criminal minds, but it's just a theory. The police found the same set of shoe prints at each of the crime scenes. Based on the measurements, the killer is a man, and most likely tall. An ultraviolet lamp turned up one stray lock of hair at one scene. Lab reports showed that the hair belonged to a man approximately 25 to 30 years old. A receipt for a bottle of whiskey was found at the last crime scene. It was purchased an hour before the murder. I can ask the seller what he remembers, if the customer wore glasses or had a limp, we could find either way with evidence this scarce this is like looking for a needle in a haystack i should examine his letter to the fbi they could be hiding further clues i just need to remove my metaphoric earplugs and keep my ears open for any hints for my message, but don't test my patience. This master is deranged. What? Who threw this letter? The serial killer known as the Master claimed another victim last night. The body of a 35-year-old man was found in an alley earlier today. Police are still investigating, but reported finding a scrap of a painting on the victim's body, along with a message, catch me if you can, detective.
Bravo. You deciphered my letter. But did you do it in time? I'm going to kill a college student named Anne Lyatt. She visits the library every evening and only goes home when it closes. Tonight will be her last time. Starting already, I see. I should be leading the case, you know. I don't know why the FBI agreed to that lunatic's demands. For all I know, you're working with him. What's in the letter? I'll take care of this. You stay here and let the professionals work. watching everything you do. have underestimated you. Freeze! Drop your weapon. You're under arrest. Please, help. I should help Anne first. Then I can follow Kaczynski and the Master. It was him, I think. I can't breathe. Please. I need <coughs> my inhaler. Thank you. The master attacked me when I left the library. He came out of nowhere. I'm still in shock. I think I should call for an ambulance. Please, find my mobile phone. I'll feel better once the doctor checks on me. Here, I found this. It might be important.
Thanks. Oh, I just remembered something from the attack. His knife. I saw the same knife at Goldman's sundry store. Maybe he got it there. Do you think Mr. Goldman would remember him? I should go, but take this. It might be useful. Another victim. The master knew I'd come here. He left a coded message for me. Thank you. 
It's been fun, detective, but playtime is over. Goldman has paid for his sins. And now it's your turn. The fire spreads fast. Too fast for you to do anything about it. Then I'll continue my work unobstructed. I can't breathe. Please, find me a wet rag. Thanks. There's no way out. The fire is blocking the back door. There's a valve in the fire hose cabinet to activate the fire suppression system. Get it open, and we might survive this. Take this. Thank you, detective. You saved my life. I'm sorry I was so suspicious, but it's my job. Now I know I can trust you. I suspect that the master is a painter. He leaves a scrap of a painting near each of his victims. It must be a message. If you find all the parts and see the full painting, it might be a clue. You should talk to the artist at the art walk. Maybe someone knows him. I inhaled a lot of smoke in there. I should go to the hospital. You've got this from here. Now, go catch that killer. Here, take this.
Excuse me, I'm Paul Simmons with the local paper. Can I ask you some questions? What do you know about the murder at the art walk this morning? Is it true that the master is connected to the art world? Oh, you probably don't want to comment until the case is concluded. Anyway, thanks for your time.
Someone shot this artist right here in the street, and I think that woman up there is the one that called us. She could be a witness. Please find her apartment and talk to her. I'll examine the scene and prepare the paperwork for Agent Toski. Take these just in case. scared me. Yes, I called the police. I heard a shot, so I looked out the window and saw a man running into the abandoned gallery. He looked like that master character from the newspaper. The victim is Clifford Hall. He's a famous local artist. Oh, he was so nice. <laughs> I can't believe someone wanted to kill him. There's an abandoned car outside. It could be the master's. Here, check the evidence and then send it to Agent Toski. He'll issue a search warrant for the car. I'd like to take you to the station and get your full testimony, ma'am. You could help us catch this guy.
Thank you for sending that evidence, Detective. I'll issue a search warrant immediately. If the witness is right, you should follow the master into the abandoned gallery. I'm faxing the warrant right now.
Detective, I'll admit I didn't expect to see you again. I was right to demand that you take my case. You're smarter than I expected, but you don't want to play by my rules. Oh, thank goodness. I'm Daniel Scott. I own the City Art Gallery. I didn't see his face, but I bet he's an artist that I refuse to exhibit. Most of them just write angry letters, but this one is taking it too far. Thanks for saving my life. Uh, here, the battery is dead, but it might be helpful.
Ann Lyatt is my one true love. I still remember when we met. I fell in love at first sight. Anne was kind to me when I lost my parents, and she never left me alone. We played together, read fairy tales, and painted. I brought her flowers and toys, hoping that we would be together forever. But she wanted another man, and it broke my heart. It was worse than death. How could she do this to me? She'll pay for her indifference. stopped me from killing Daniel Scott, but will you save his beloved Linda Collins? I hope you've learned that it's no use cheating in my game. Here's a hint for you. She's there, underground.
almost died in there. But you saved my life. He attached this timer to me. You should take it. He mentioned someone named Toski in the garment factory. It's not far, just behind the gate. I better go to the hospital. Good luck, detective.
see that you saved Linda just in time. Let's see you do the same for Agent Toski. You must repair all of the machines here to get to Toski. It's your only hope of saving him.
sound of the machines. I fell asleep to that sound after my poor father moved our entire family to his factory. He fired some of the workers, and my mother and I worked here for free just to survive. But we couldn't save the factory, and now nothing can save Agent Toski.
Ugh, my chest! I'm glad I was wearing body armor. The master is so caught up in a sick game that he didn't notice I wasn't dead. <laughs> he went to the roof. He has a lot of scraps of painting with him, which can only mean he plans to kill a lot more people. Please, stop him before he hurts anyone else. Ugh, I think I broke a rib. I'll call for backup and meet them here. Here, take this. Soon you'll pay for everything you've done to me. Your portrait will join my collection.
Well, you made it. What are you waiting for? Kill me. Just like Goldman killed my mother by firing her from his store. Or like Kaczynski killed my father by confiscating his factory. Or like Ann Lyatt killed my soul to marry that loser Clifford Hall. I'd be a normal man if it weren't for these people. Instead, I have nothing left to live for. Thanks for your help. The Master signed his own death warrant when he demanded that we bring you onto the case. He'll be taken into custody, and he'll get what he deserves. <laughs>